there, fishy folks, and welcome back to Michael's Fish Room. Today, an unboxing of an import order. Grab yourself a healthy snack and beverage. Stand by. All right, fishy folks, in an attempt to find the best prices and quality for you guys, uh, I've been trying some different importers, and uh, this is somebody I've tried a few times before. I'm trying to really get the best quality. Um, and so one of the things he suggested is I come to his warehouse and pick the guppies up there because there's less travel involved for them. So that's what I did. I drove up. Uh, about two hours from my house into the city to grab them and uh, I just got home a little while ago and I wanted to do an unboxing for you. So, without further ado, let's take a look at some gorgeous guppies. Alright fishy folks, we got seven different kinds, about 300 pairs of guppies. Um, and I'll just show you them in the bag and then of course I'll show you them in the tank. So restocking red dragons we got 44 pair total so this is this is actually half of them they look really good this batch looks really good I'm just gonna put them over here uh, we got some dumbo ear red tails which uh, I don't know if you can see how big their dumbo ears are but they're ginormous now keep in mind they're stressed they're in a bag they just flew in last night and then uh, I picked them up this morning so little stress they'll color up Looking, looking forward to them. Here we have a uh, huge request from you guys, Blue Topaz. So uh, looking forward to these coloring up. All right. Japan Blue Mosaics. More red dragons. Let's just take a look and see what's in here. Yeah, they're looking good, this batch. All right. Metal black. Everybody looks healthy. Little on the small side. They're young. Albino full white. Another uh, huge request. Albino full white. We've had those on the website. Albino platinum is another name for them. And then the last strain are these albino big ears. Also a big seller. The ears are actually see-through, sort of, so it's hard to see them, but they're, they're pretty big. All right, fishy folks, I am going to find tank space and uh, get them acclimatized and get them in the tanks, and then I'll come back. Refill your snack and beverage if you need to. All right, fishy folks, let's take a look at the guppies. It is about a day later. Um, these are the albino blue topaz. I've already started treating with levamisole flake. I will start the rest of the quarantine process, which will include Furan 2 and some ick medication after I'm done with this video. But I, I want to show you the guppies without medicine in the water so you can see how sexy they look. And of course, there's some little itty bitty uh, albino pleco fry in here as well. Uh, moving on, we're going to say hi to our boy Taco. What's up, buddy? Hi. Hi. And of course, can't leave out Hank, who's hiding. Hi, Hank. Over here we have the Japanese Blue Mosaics. And you might be saying to yourself, but, but Mike, it looks like there's three or four different male species and a couple of different females. And that's right. Not species, but strains. Uh, these are just all mutts. There are some Japanese Blue Mosaics, but I can't sell them to you because they're all... I don't know what females go with them because there's like three different females and four different males and there's some mutts, so... I've already spoken to the my uh, distributor and, and, and he handled it, but a little disappointing because the Japanese blue mosaics that are actually in this tank are pretty nice looking. So uh, once these go through quarantine, they'll go in the mutt tank and I'll be done with that. And I'm, it's unfortunate, but it happens. Over here, we have some super sexy Dumbo ear red tails. Look at that female with the dumbos. That's nice. But the males with the big ears and the platinum body with the super bright red tail. I really like these guys. Doing well. Very healthy. Um, really lively. Like I said, I've already started treating with levamisole flake. Um, and I haven't seen any any worms come out. So that's pretty good. They, they all came in. All the guppies came in pretty healthy. So I'm pretty happy. 
Over here we have the Red Dragon Half Moons, the most popular guppy on my website. Uh, there's only 40 pair in here, and uh, I know on the waiting list there's at least 10 people. So if you're looking to get some of these, as soon as they uh, go on my website right now and sign up for email uh, notifications, and uh, once I, I put them live, which will be next week, you'll be notified and you can go ahead and order them. Here we have the albino big ears. Now, these are pretty nice. They came in a little small because they're young, but uh, we're gonna try to fatten them up over the next two weeks before uh, they start shipping. They'll be out of quarantine in two weeks. I'll put them on the website uh, in a week so that people can order them and then the following week they'll start shipping. But uh, they look really nice. Um, the pectoral fins are clear, so they're hard to see, but they're big, which is nice. Nice. Uh, down here, again, another mistake. These are the metal blacks, um, but they're just, they're really not metal. They're kind of just mosaic, I mean, uh, Moscow, so not a big deal. I'll sell them as Moscow's. Black Moscow's are a pretty big seller on my website, too. So uh, I'm disappointed because I wanted the metals, but oh well, stuff happens. Uh, these are the Albino Full Platinums, and uh, not a fan of these at all, but you guys seem to love them. Another very popular strain on michaelsfishroom.com. Uh, also came in really nice and healthy, pretty happy with these. And I think that does it for guppies. All the new guppies came in nice. We had some issues with some strains, which happens. And, you know, maybe many business people don't talk about the negative stuff about this hot, this business. But, you know, I, I got these. I spent money for Japanese blue mosaic, and I won't be able to sell them as Japanese blue mosaics. Now, some people might pull the nice ones out and sell them with whatever female they can, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to sell them as mutts. They're gorgeous fish, don't get me wrong. Even the mutt ones, like that one, is pretty nice looking. Uh, but that's going to happen. And, uh, you know, I've talked to my distributor about it. We're working on a plan to fix it. So we'll see what happens. There's also a shrimp in this tank that it's right there. It's been here for about a month. I don't know where it came from. It's like Immaculate Conception or something. It must have come in on the plants. But, uh, yeah, so shrimp. Might be a snack for a guppy. Maybe it won't be. Maybe it'll clean up the algae. I don't know. I don't care. All right, fishy folks. That does it for the unboxing. We'll say bye to Taco. Bye, Taco. <laughs> Refill your snack and bed. bed blah, 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 blah.